What's going on guys? How's everyone doing today? It's Monday, 7.45. I was supposed to put up my video last night, but yeah, I came over here. I had to take my brother and mom to the airport. They're in Mexico, so check that out. I'll talk more about it later, but let's get right on to Central Tech. Man, I graduated uh, with a weighted grade of 96. I'm going to show you some papers here in a minute. Um, but as part of the graduation, you get this hat, a little Central Tech hat. And with that Central Tech hat, it says Central, Tre Central Tech Truck Driver Training, Drumright, Oklahoma. Uh, and then, of course, on the brim right here, it reads Central Tech. So uh, the only people who have that are the people who graduated, graduated the class. Not even the instructors have it. So um, it was good, man. Tuesday and Wednesday, we did our night driving. Uh, Tuesday, we drove at night around the range to get used to it. Wednesday, we took about a 40-mile 40, 40 trip uh, around around the town. So, um, you know, I drove, my brother drove 40 miles in, in, like, dusk, came back to the school. I got in, did my 40, came back to the school. We ended it on that. So, um, other than that, Thursday, we washed trucks, the six that we used. And Friday was our graduation. Short day, they showed us a video on uh, a couple things. The safety director, Mark Brown, came in. He's a great guy. Um, he's doing a lot of great things. You'll have to call the school to find out. Um, but let's get on it. Let's see. For Central Tech, here's the paperwork that you get. Um, congratulations. Complete, completed truck driving school. Um, as you can see here, that's my academic grade. Got a, well, I don't know if you could see it, but I got a 93 on that. Wish I could hear. What really killed me was the vehicle systems at 84. So um, then on the skills grades, driving 97. So it weighted out to a 96. The skills is 75% of your grade. Uh, the academic is 25%. So uh, everything above a 90 on the skills. The final road test was a 91. Grinded a couple gears right out of the gate. It was a Monday, so what are you going to do? Uh, it told, tells you your total miles, 513 total miles. Um, hours in the classroom, uh, you know, 46 and a three-quarter hours of observation. And then this is pretty much what you get when you complete it. Uh, the certificate, it just states that you've completed 215 hours and achieved the instructional objectives uh, in the program. It gives you the PDTI. Uh, certified course graduate and then also the central tech is the gold one the PDTI is this one right here uh, so it is a PDTI school it is one of the best in the uh, in the country it's by, I would say it's probably top three or top five uh, besides that now I'm I want to show you actually my logbook this is something you're gonna have to fill out every day they try to replicate uh, the truck driver training so let me go ahead and find you um, my log. I'm going to see if I can find you the Oklahoma City trip or maybe the big cabin trip. So bear with me just one second. You know, it's been a great school. I kind of miss it, to tell you the truth. Last night I was thinking about it, and I was just, you know, kind of like, you know, it's Sunday at 9.30. I'd usually be back at the school getting ready to go back to class and see my instructor and what have you. So, you know, it's a bit of a bummer, but what can you do? It's It's over. It, it was, you know, like I said, I miss it because it was such a great school. Uh, they had a lot to offer, so let me see here. Right, this is just one of them. This wasn't a, a big trip. It was actually, uh, I drove 22 miles. My partner must have drove 21 because we had 43 total miles. So here it is, if you can see it. You're going to start your day right here. You're off duty. I dropped down to on duty, not driving. In which you can see the pre-trip, the little swing bar over here. It says pre-trip right there. And then I didn't drive uh, up until 9 o'clock. Then from 9 to 10.45, I moved up and started driving. Went back to not driving. Had our lunch, so we took off duty up here. Back down to not driving, but on duty. And then I drove, and then back to off duty for the rest of the night. You got to fill them out like that. Uh, you want to put your mileage, your total mileage, your tractor your trailer number, uh, the carrier, and the location, and also where you went. So I went from Drumright, Oklahoma, to Cushing, Oklahoma, and returned and back to Drumright. So 
This is just something you fill out. Uh, there's there's numerous logs. You do one every day. You're in school from the, you know pretty much uh, 20 out of 23 days. You do one. So here's all of them that I've done. Uh, it's good. Like I said, I miss it. Uh, just to give you a final review on the school, phenomenal school. If you guys are you know, in the Midwest or you really don't care how far you travel to get into school or whatever it may be, Central Tech is the place to go. Uh, like I said, probably a top three school in the country. The instructors are phenomenal. The trucks are four years old or newer. Just a, a great program, the great range, as you saw by my video. You can go in more than one directions as well, but, um, you know, I don't want to uh, disrespect them in any way or, uh, you know, do things that's not right, but I did want to give you guys a glimpse of it. And I'm probably going to be in contact with my, my trainer, Mr. Elliot. So, uh, you know, I probably will tell him to check out the videos. I mean, I give him the school and him nothing but great reviews. They've been phenomenal. Uh, you can't really ask for anything more. They, they make you get the job done. Uh, they're serious about it, but they can have a good time, and that's what you expect. It's, uh, you know, you don't want to be there and you'd be miserable for 23 days. So they make light of it. Time flies before you know it. You'll have your CDL, uh, and you actually get it about a week and a half before the school ends. So it was a phenomenal class. Uh, Mr. Elliot, Monacella, uh, Mr. Dennis, uh, they're all phenomenal instructors. Mitten Witten, Mr. Witten is a great guy as well. Like I said, my only problem was uh, being a little bit hard of hearing in my left ear. It was tough to hear some of the things he said, but he's a real good guy. They're all phenomenal. Uh, again, Mr. Brown, uh, phenomenal. He's the uh, safety director. Janet's the front desk. Uh, so, you know, they're all, they're all really great people. Um, and that's about that. You know, from here on out, I'm, I actually, this week, um, I got to yeah, apply for a couple more places. I got to go get my uh, tanker and hazmat endorsement. So I'm going to be studying for that till about Wednesday, maybe take it Thursday up at uh, DMV in Yukon. Um, because I, you know, I, I really thought I wanted to work locally, uh, from the beginning. And then I figured, Hey, you know what? I'll work over the road. Uh, but I really do want to work locally. I want to be able to have that weekend time or, or, you know, at least some steady days off home at night so I can hang out with friends, my girlfriend, um, be able to work out, get out a little bit more and still, still try to save some money. So if I have a couple more bills, so be it, but I think it would be worth it. Plus I know they say if you go local, it's harder to get over the road. You know, I really don't know about that because you've got to take into consideration that a lot of these companies want people to go over the road. You know, not everyone wants to do that. So, you know, if you have a year or two locally, yeah, you might have to spend a week or two in the truck with a trainer. But, you know, they're not, it's not like they're going to say, oh, you just have local experience. Sorry, we're not going to hire you. I mean, you, you drove a truck for two years. You have a clean record. You know, it's better than where we are today, right? So that's my game plan. Um, you know, next week I'll be telling you. I'm actually, next week, I'm going to give you a review of all the recruiters I speak to from Warner, U.S. Express. I'm going to try to go and get accepted to Schneider over the road because I was accepted to their dedicated route, but I don't like truck hopping. So, um, Crete still has yet to call me back. I'm going to give him a call tomorrow. Uh, my job history, I'm sure, is not that great, but being in construction, you know, what can you do? So, and then I'm going to fill out applications and call up things, local companies like Shepard, uh, see maybe if Chesapeake will hire me. So, we'll see what's going on. Next week, I'll tell you that. I'll tell you my progress. I'll tell you who I'm going with. I'm going to try to get to some orientation uh, and training, hopefully, by next Wednesday. I mean, you know, there's some people already, you know, I know my buddy is already at TMC. This was his first day of orientation today on Monday, so... Um, he's already getting into it, uh, and I'd like to get going soon too and make some money, but keep in tune. I'm going to let you guys know what all the recruiters have to say. I'll give you a rundown on that. Uh, also, check out my brother's vlog. Again, it's Mo's Mojo 78 Again, he's in Mexico. He had a surgery today, from what I heard. Went well. He's recovering, um, you know, so I'm, you know, I'm thankful for that, and, you know, I'm sure he'll be back vlogging about that. You guys, uh, you know, keep subscribing. Uh, you know, give me some more comments soon. It's not going to be just looking at me talk. It's going to be, uh, you know, showing you some of the roads in my truck. And I'm going to try to do, you know, all that for you guys. So, again, Central Tech, I give them, out of 100, I would say I'd give them about 93. Uh, but also, I heard a lot of things how they got their budget cut. So, a couple of the trucks they have that need to be work on, they're internationals. Uh, you can't really bust on them too bad um, but all their trucks are phenomenal the instructors phenomenal 
you get tons of driving trips. I have 513 miles driving. So um, check out Central Tech. It's, uh, it's uh, I believe it's tdt-ok.com is their website. Or if you want to give them a call, go ahead and give them a call at 800 Four five eight seven eight two five. Great school, great instructors, great people. Uh, they really teach you. They really get your job done. Sorry, I'm sweating. I just came out of my Maz jacuzzi. I'm over here watching the dogs and cats. So, um, stay tuned. I'll let you guys know what's going on. I hope everyone has a good week. Had a good past weekend, and uh, I'll catch you on the flip side. Peace.